Hello friends, welcome to Tabletop Tonight. Good to see y'all. Thank you, Brothers Murph, for the raid. Here we are. Thanks to AEG, our raid leader. Much appreciated. Um, we love their games. Check out their new games. We got Cascadia 10 and Whirling Witchcraft, which we uh, saw John Lorena play earlier. We hope y'all are having a great time. Thank you for joining us today. Thanks for the follows. This is our pug, Bruno. He wanted to be part of the celebration today. And uh, Bruno, how are you doing today? <laughs> he yawns. Oh, sweet baby. Friends, we hope you're having a great TLN. We've been enjoying um, watching y'all, um, all the other streamers, and we want to thank you for joining us. We've got our costumes on. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, Piero Jim just followed. Um, Piero, when you follow here, we do analog alerts on our channel. So we have Felicia the Followfish. She swims around, says hello, and then she swims away, says hello to all the new followers, and all of us, including y'all in chat, we say, Bye, Bye, Felicia. Felicia. Thanks for the follow. We've got bits being spent. Thank you, uh, Slivers, uh, for the bits. Thank you, Brain in a Jar. Brain in a Jar is going to be streaming a we little later train. tonight. Yeah. Oh, we got a hype train on. We, there's the hype train. And here oh, is. Oh, uh -oh, no. Let's we'll click off for Bruno. Hi, friends. I'm Benny the Bits Bear. You spend bits. I show up out of. Come out of hibernation and say hello to you all. Thank you, Slivers. Thank you, Sarvillian. Thank you, Brain in a Jar. T L N. T L N. T L N. Oh, Bruno. Oh, now he's all about the hype train. Apparently. Yeah, Bruno. Uh, we love TLN. We love being part of it. Thank you, friends. Um, talk about your stream stacks, what you're eating and or drinking. Uh, we had our dinner earlier, a little um, chicken and rice and veggies. And wow, Bruno really wants a hype train. <laughs> really does. Wow, um, we might have to give it to. We might just have to give Bruno the. Bruno, hype. oh Bruno. my goodness! Thanks for uh, redeeming points for Bruno tricks and treats. Uh, there's. Well, you have the real Bruno here, but uh, there's a <laughs> trick for you. <laughs> <laughs> and then how about a treat for Bruno? The digital uh, bringer. Ah, oh, good boy. <laughs> Thank you, Amanda. Oh. Thank you, AB True, for all the bits. <laughs> AB True's cheered 549 bits. Thank you, AB True. Whoa. Oh, we get uh, Bruno. <laughs> Bruno is Thank all you, about True. this hype train. Oh, yeah. Bruno's yeah. all excited about the hype train. Thank you, friends. You spend bits, I show up. Okay, we're going to sing a song. We'll sing my theme song. Ready? Benny and the bits, 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 bits. Bop, bop, ba da, bop. Thank you, friends. Oh, like, what's the theme song? <laughs> Lauren has not been here for, you haven't streamed with us in a while, oh my Lauren. Goodness, it's been a Bruno. while. Yeah. Are we giving this to Bruno? Because he's totally fighting me for this. Wow. Um, yeah, I guess. Okay, Bruno has earned the hype train. Folks, y'all started the hype train. Bruno's going to end it. Go ahead, Bruno. Take the hype train. Okay, Bruno. Oh, oh. oh. Y'all can't see me. He's just attacking it. Oh, oh no. Uh, camera. Why that play has also cheered 100 bits. Thank you, why that play. Um... <laughs> I'm missing messages, I believe. It's always a crazy time when we start these uh, TLN streams. Thank you so much. We're, we're happy to see y'all here. Thanks for the Bye Belishas. Um, this music is intense. Oh, yeah. Perfect Night Cage. The Night Cage, this is the official, well, I don't know if it's official, but uh, our friends at Spork and Dagger, who are our sponsors, they sent us this soundtrack. So thank you. Let us know if it's a little too loud for your taste. Um, we're going to keep it going because, you know, it's a spooky time. You know, we want that uh, atmosphere going on. Um, let's see. Thank you for the bits, everyone. Hi, everyone. Just curious. Thoughts on games uh, best at two, but still good at three or four. And that is from I Pay My Debts. Mm -hmm. That's a great question. Um, games great that are... game. <laughs> Folks, if you know any games, type them in chat. Well, I'd love to hear them, too. Uh, right off the top of my head, I think of Castles of Burgundy, but then, you know, it plays two to four. I actually like Castles of Burgundy at two best, because three and four, you can be a little AP prone. Um, other two, well, like Azul is a classic, right? I like that one. We played yeah. that at two, three, and four. Always enjoy it. But uh, yeah, keep them coming, folks. Bosonator has been driving since two p.m. What? Sometimes service is a lot, but I'm uh, it's bad. But I am watching. Oh, awesome fonts. Drive safely. Yeah, drive safely. Be, be careful out there. Uh, <laughs> I'm on the train. Uh, get, yeah, get. We gave Bruno a high train. He, he's got it. Uh, Zhao's here. Hi, guys. Uh, nice to see you again. <laughs> yeah, hi, Zhao. You were just here the other day. Appreciate you coming back. Um, Sliver is saying hi to Bonds. Juicy Fruits, Cascadia. Oh, Cascadia is wonderful at all player counts. Cascadia, yeah. one of my favorites this year. I'm going to take the hype train. Well, no, the hype train still going on, folks. Keep going with the hype train. I'm going to keep it on. What I'm going to do Bruno is... Bruno took off with the hype train. <laughs> yeah, Bruno actually took off with our hype train. I'm going to switch this out. We have our Halloween names. By the way, can y'all y'all know what costumes we are? Can we get some love for the costumes? Um, yeah. Michelle and I dressed in a pair today. And Lauren, do y'all know who Lauren is? Thank you, uh, Tor. Oh, thank you, Tor. Good to see you, Victor. 
Um, she was afraid that no one would know her costume. Um, so let's see. I don't know. Okay, there's Lauren. Do you there's have any? The clue. <laughs> do you have any lines from this particular character you would like to share with the audience? Um. Do you know what the happiest animal in the world is? Uh, it's a goldfish. A goldfish. You want to know why? Why? Goldfish only has a 10 second memory. Oh. Uh-huh. Gil Goots. Thank you, Gil Goots. Yes, we, uh, Michelle and I are the Black Eyed Peas. Uh-huh. Thank you. And someone shout out to, uh, to Living Nice in LA. Thank you, to Living Nice in LA. <laughs> I can fill two internets with what I don't know about soccer. <laughs> <laughs> Nice, nice, nice. Oh, give some love for the stash of Lauren. Very nice. <laughs> um, speaking of, you know, it is Halloween, folks. We have our um, Halloween names. We have Witch L, Goran, and Boo L. So <laughs> if you have a Halloween name, please type them in chat. We'd love to hear um, what your Halloween names are as well. We hope everyone's having a good uh, TLN. Uh, have, have you always uh, been enjoying yourselves? Have you been playing games while watching? That's what I want to know. Um, because this is a long weekend for, well, it's a regular weekend, what am I talking about? But, you know, it's full of spooks and scares and fun times at the game table. And I would love to hear what y'all are playing. Are you playing scary games, non-scary games, or are you are you playing games at all? Let, let us know. We'd love to hear. Um, Lauren, you haven't been here for a while. Yeah. So how does it feel to be back in the studio, the home studio? Uh feels good i'm ready to play all right this game kind of reminds me of uh one of the mini games on mario party oh really yeah like you're like walking around a maze and you okay. don't know where you're going and like the little like ghosts come out oh okay i i haven't played mario party and i don't think i've ever no i have played mario party back like on the gamecube oh no i haven't Okay, I played Mario Kart. Is that that's the, the racing? Yeah, one. the racing. I haven't played Mario Kart. Have you played Mario Kart again? Nope. No. Okay. Well, there's another reference we don't get. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's a. I think there's a quote in there. Is that a Ted Lasso quote, Lauren? Can you see that one? No. James is playing a horrified in Cascadia tomorrow. Oh, well, nice. Uh, most likely before seeing Dune. Awesome. Okay. Gil. Ah, oh, wet wet cardboard. It's <laughs> okay. Well, Gil. So David Phillips says my in real life name is that's him officer well, it was tough to I think change that one up for Halloween oh okay. <laughs> <laughs> nice uh Rise of Mages says oh Day of the Dead games for me next week oh yeah perfect yeah we've been hearing a lot of love for Dune I, mm-hmm. I really want to see it have, do you have any interest in seeing Dune either of you I thought Dune was a board game it is, is a board game too it oh, is also a board I game don't I, based, I have no idea what Dune is yeah based on a novel or the movie based on a novel from many, many decades ago. Well, I just keep hearing good things about the movie Doom. It's supposed now to be I amazing. Like I really want to watch it. it. Yeah, I really want to watch it. Um, <laughs> Bruno is, watch it. is yeah. going to town. <laughs> oh. Bruno just destroyed the hype train. Oh, oh, I thought you were reading uh, Chaz's comment. This took me a while to get the Black Eyed Peas thing. I was. I was thinking <laughs> Pittsburgh Pirates and got derailed in my train of thought. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah, got derailed from the hype train. Uh, yeah, the peas. Yeah, I, I get it with the black. And, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> An award-winning costume. <laughs> it, it is. You want to talk about that? How we actually won something for this? Yeah. <laughs> so this was many, many years ago. We did a 5K, and it was around this time. And, you know, you can dress up or, or not. And this is what we did. But I think we had more, like... Um, athletic wear on just yeah, because we were yeah. running so um we won i think what second place it was second place yeah like you remember the first place no i don't the first place was that uh the woman who dressed as uh, what's the rosie the riveter rosie the riveter yeah she had the full-on costume she ran and i was like wow that was great and then michelle and i got second place what a little bu- uh it was like a hundred bucks yeah, yeah, yeah. hundred bucks. <laughs> sweet um ooh, excuse me so Zhao says it took me a little oh that, that's what you just read um, people love it. Star Wars was uh, inspired heavily by Dune. Yes, I've, I've heard that before. Uh, nice on second place. Thanks. Uh, we're going to play the Night Cage. We're also giving away a copy, friends. So stick around. We'll be giving away a copy of the Night Cage. So I want to thank our sponsor, uh, Smirk and Dagger. Um, and sometime during the stream, we are going to be giving you like the word to type in the chat. And then we'll pull a winner from chat. Again, uh, TLN's going on until tomorrow, folks. We, we're just getting started, basically. Uh, if you want the schedule, I just dropped it there. Yeah, one more time for our Ray Leader and uh, all the all the, uh, the things here. Um, please remember, we are playing, or please.
Be sure to check out a Sparking Dagger's side. Can you scroll down a little bit? Yeah. So, Vilia? Uh-huh. Said that they and their wife always dress in costume when they run 5Ks. Last one was bootlegger themed, and they were the old, they were literally the only two people uh, dressed in. I love that. That's awesome. <laughs> only bootlegger. Oh, well, you know what? Funny thing, when we um, ran the 5K, we ran into one of my former students who actually, like, ran track. Yeah. And we're like, well, we just did it for fun season. We're not runners. <laughs> yeah, definitely not runners here. I was like, oh. Yeah, you go on with your bad self. <laughs> <laughs> Meeple Conrad's uh, cheered 100 bits. Thank you, Meeple Conrad. Appreciate it. Folks, Meeple Conrad. Hello, Meeple Conrad. If you don't know, Meeple Conrad is now part of TLN. Thank you, Meeple Conrad, for all of your support. We are looking forward to your stream tomorrow. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we need to do like a TLN sign. Here's you know, T. Like... There's the L. Oh, you know, Michelle got the N. I don't know how you make it. Uh, like that. Oh, there you go. Oh, Lauren can do the F. <laughs> so it's T-L-N. <laughs> T-N-N. <laughs> We're confused. <laughs> Griff Dog says, really enjoy the Night Cage. Really fun co-op game with a seriously creepy feeling. Yeah. So let, what, you know, let's jump right into it, friends. Uh, this is the Night Cage. So Michelle, Lauren, and I are prisoners in this otherworldly prison. We are trapped and our mission is to find the four keys, get to the gate, and escape. Um, so what we're going to do first is uh, do a little setup here. Y'all are going to play along with us here and uh, see if we can escape here. I am playing the yellow uh, yellow player today. So as startup, um, we're going to place our starting tile somewhere. I'll put mine right here. Put my <laughs> character in there. What's up, buddy? Chow says, will you keep uh, the Ted Lasso spirit during the spooky uh, crawl in the dark of the night cage? You're darn tootin' I will. <laughs> <laughs> May the mustache guide you through. <laughs> okay, and then as a starter, I just place a tile. And then, Michelle, you will do the same thing, please. Okay, I do not have to be connected to... Correct. You can go anywhere on the board. And by the way, the boards uh, do wrap Lauren likes Pac-Man, so you can go from here to the other side. And from Ooh. down here. Okay, just FYI. Can you grab me a... Yep. Thing. Starting tile. Okay. Um, hmm... Dare Drinker, thanks for the resub. Much appreciated. Wow, Dare Drinker's been sub for 13 months. Well done, friend. Okay. Wait, okay. so I put this that one down anywhere. anywhere. And then you'll choose another tile from the, the melting candle. Yes, so this is the timer, basically. I don't know if y'all can see this. This is an actual candle. Fall out. Not an actual candle, but a candle uh, tray for the tiles. So we're playing our, you know, we are in this dark prison and we only have candlelight to guide us. So we'll talk, we'll show you how. Uh, My shoes is a side. Right? Correct. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah, the other side's a pit. I can fill two internets with what I don't know about <laughs> this game. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And then now we're playing a three player game. So the fourth player is actually a dummy player. We'll take turns controlling. Uh, we're going to call, we won't call it a dummy player. We'll play, this is Bruno. So Michelle, can you place this in order for Bruno, please? Sure. And Bruno's tile, or token, and the tile. Okay. Okay. And that's set up, folks. Pretty pretty straightforward. Now, we're going to uh, take our turns, and real quick, this is our play raid. Each one of us has these. Um, look on the left side there. Your turn is either move one space or stay where you are. If you stay where you are, you're going to gain one nerve, which are these tokens. And the nerves, you can see on the right side of the player aid, give you the ability to move again, to block us when monsters are attacking, to charge, also talking about monsters, we'll get to those later. Sustain, that's during final flickers, that's basically when we get to the end of the candle, when we run out of tiles, uh, we can do stuff there. And then two nerves is the maximum, you may stay, but you will not gain more than two. Um, and I'll talk about when we get knocked, or lights out, and stuff like that. But... Basically, the game is you decide where to move and then you, um, onto any other tile. So I'll take the yellow, I'll move down to the little X there, please. And the way this works is the tile that you're on, you illuminate all the orthogonal tiles or spaces. So by illuminating them, that means you can see what's next. So I get this, I get one, two, three. This is already illuminated, so that's there. And three. So what I'm going to do is, why don't I put. Um, 
this one here, um, this one like this, and I'll put the X. Okay, so now on a, my next turn, if I move over here, this is no longer adjacent to me. This is no longer adjacent to me. This is either. So these get removed from the game. All three, four All of three. those? One, two, and three. This one actually will oh, okay. flip over um, to... Oh, no, this one also goes away. Okay. The ones that flip over are the ones with the, crack, uh, the crumbling around it. Okay. Actually, no, this has crumble, so it'd become a pit. If you go in the pit, you will fall down the pit, and we'll talk about that later. So that's the end of my turn. Um, Michelle. Okay, so I go by this one, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I need two tiles, please. I'll let you do that, Mark. Griptock says, we all need a little more nerve. Agreed. <laughs> <laughs> so if we only need to get four keys, why are there five on the board? Um... I think it comes with five, and I just threw them all out there. Because, oh, okay. yeah, you can play five players, and, yeah. Okay, so... Let's see. Oh, so you have to move first on oh. the tile. Oh, okay. Then you illuminate. Okay, illuminating. Um, all right. I think I will do this, and I will do this. Yeah, let's oh, clear the time. actually, yeah, that was just an example. I was sorry, I was over here. I was just that was just an example. I did not move. I my first move was move here, then put those tiles, and that's gonna return. Okay, so I'm done, right? Yep. Okay. Thanks, little grip dog. No worries. Uh, music definitely helps create atmosphere. This one, yeah, awesome. Okay. Let's illuminate. So I put the non crumbly. Oh, okay, yeah. Wait. So Lauren, oh, go ahead. You have found the key. Yay! This is a good, a great thing actually. So go ahead and grab a key and put it on there. So when you go move on to that space, you will collect that key. Each of us, we may carry one key at a time. Uh, if you go to an adjacent space with another prisoner, um, you can exchange or give them a key. You cannot carry more than two or more than one. But however, remember the illumination rule. If you move away, let's just say you went here for some reason. Any um, tile that's not adjacent to you will um, go away. So this one would go away and we'd lose that key, which you do not want to do. Okay. So just to check, um, so this is the end of Lauren's move. We're just going to check. So that's illuminated by Lauren. This one is two. This one is two. This one's not illuminated by Lauren, but I am illuminating it with my candle. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. And Buno. Yeah. Okay. D is here. Hi. Uh, I almost missed... Uh, I almost missed. I've seriously got to talk to Twitch about these over here. Yeah, we'll, we'll talk to Twitch for, for you, Community. Okay, so Bruno moves. Okay, good boy, Bruno. And... I just picture a little pug with a candle. <laughs> so he only gets one? Correct. Oh. Oh, oops. What, what is this? Oh, it's the candle... The oh, wax eater. Wax eater. Who earned? So that's a monster, folks. Not a good thing. Bruno found a monster. So the monster, the way that works, if you move onto that tile or anywhere in a direct line, across, sorry, Lauren, across or below, um, adjacent to it, across here or down here, it's going to attack. And by attacking, the monster takes away three tiles. Oh, no. That is not a good thing. So right now, it's safe. No, but Bruno just wants to be friends with the I know. Bruno, I can see Bruno. The wax eater. The wax eater. Yeah. Be friends. He wants to be friends. <laughs> um yeah, he he really likes the hype train. Oh, Bruno. you may need to buy a new one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now it's my turn. Um, I need to. Question. Yeah. Does it matter that this tile got played here, so the green one is actually? In... Yeah. Oh, oh. So the good thing is, uh, as long as there's no direct uh, uh, passage to this one, you're the green oh. player is safe. Yeah, okay. this is like blocked off. Gotcha. Okay, it has to be direct. Okay, so I am well, going I question. to... Yeah, question. Sorry. No worries. Okay, so had I done this... Uh-huh. So, well, okay. It was just because when you said that this connects... Yes. It, oh, it, it does connect. Yeah, it does wrap around. Yes. So if, if you had done, done, that, done that, that's a blocker. Okay. Yeah. But yeah. yeah. I thought about that. Yeah. Okay. So now it is connected then, right? Uh, it is, is that connected. right? You're correct, yeah. Who earns... Oh, I forgot about the fracture tiles. Yeah, so the ones, once you move off of these, the crumbly ones, we have to turn them over. So this is now a pit. Okay, so this one is also? Yep. And 
in this example. Yep. Thanks, uh, Grip Dog, for the uh, reminder. So this one hasn't yet because I haven't gone there. But I'm going to go. Ooh, I want to get that. Well, you're going to get that key, Lauren. Mm -hmm. So I'll, I'll let that go. So I'm going to go here. And then I am no longer adjacent to this. So this uh, goes away, even though it, was, it crumbled before. Now it goes away. Um, I put this over here. This is the start tile. Uh, we just started it. Uh, just a quick look. Uh, let me see. This one here. So we have this discard pile um, board. And um, what you can do is keep track of the tiles that you've gotten rid of. Okay. Oh, you're taking a picture of Bruno? Yeah. With, uh, <laughs> with the hype train. <laughs> okay. So as you uh, bring tiles off the... Um, board you can see how many are left in the deck okay so uh we have we're not playing with the three pit fiends or these type of monsters but we can keep track of hey there are exactly four gates in the game if we put four uh, tiles here we know we've lost the game uh there are six key tiles etc and there's you can see all the numbers here okay so let me uh Show the good people what looks like yeah this... oh actually you try see? this camera right here oh uh, Lauren just took a picture of Bruno uh, destroying the <laughs> hype train, folks. <laughs> should put that on the Discord. <laughs> yeah, we'll show that on Discord. If you don't follow us on Discord, please do. There's the Discord. I'll drop that. Oh, I don't know if I have that link set up. <laughs> okay. So, uh, why don't I draw, put tiles here. One. Ooh, there's a gate. I pulled a gate. Um, oh, you know what I'm going to do? I'll do this here. Okay. And then the gate I'll put here. And then this one I'll put here. So now I am not illuminating this anymore. So that goes away. Yeah, that should have, no, that should not have crumbled. Uh, I am illuminating one, two, three, four. This one, no one's illuminating. This one here goes away. So we have lost that, and we have lost that. And I believe that's the end of my turn. Okay. Okay, so for my... Gilgut says more like a bike train. Michelle <laughs> <laughs> uh, says, I'm trying to remember if the hold could help Bruno escape an attack, um, because he's very stuck there. Hold yeah. lets you get away sometimes. Yeah, the, the pit... can help Bruno on. Oh. Yeah, so Bruno went onto the pit. Uh, basically, you take your character off the board, and then you're gonna you can come in on um, either the same column or row as that pit. So, and he would he he would be safe from the attack. But oh, is it is it Bruno's turn right no, now? No, it's my, oh, my okay, turn. Yeah. No, I thought it was my turn. Did yeah. that go second? Uh, I go, then your mom, and oh. then you, and then Bruno. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, so if I move here. Do I only put a tile here? Uh, yeah. Okay, and that thing goes here. Yeah, and okay. you will be um, you will be attacked by the monster because anytime you move in any line that's connected oh. to the monster, you will be attacked. And there's nothing to do there. Um, now you can. They go in the pit. Yeah, you you can go in the pit or you can spend a nerve. So when um, when a monster attack would discard exactly three cards, you can discard two instead. Or this is for uh, to charge, move onto a mountain, but yeah, you won't be able to charge because you're not that close. Huh. Yeah, it's sort of a rough, uh, rough spot to be in. Yeah. Okay, That's well, I don't really have a choice. Yeah, you really don't. Um, I don't know. What do you think? Do you think I should go here or here? Um. I mean, I guess it really doesn't matter. Yeah. Okay, shall let's just go down. Yeah, let's go. Let's okay. go down. Go there. Okay. okay. So then I need a tile. Yeah. Okay. Um. Okay. Did I do that? I guess. Okay. All right. And okay. so then now the monster attacks, and you just take out three uh, tiles. Okay. So. Oh, Zhao said down the pit, I meant LOL, sorry. Down uh, the pit, like this way? Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, so go ahead. Me and Zhao are going to be a Okay, team. We'll, we'll, we'll retcon that. Okay, okay so. You're there. So okay. now what happens? So at the end of your turn, you're going to fall down that pit. It's so you fall in. So you take your player piece off the board. And now see the um, 
Yeah, you can do the row or the column going up or down from um, that pit. Well, if I put it here, it's not going to... Well, either place, it's not going to allow me to go anywhere. Yeah, you're right? going gonna, to... Gonna, when you come back aboard on your next turn, uh -huh. you're going to choose any uh, uh, place on that tile or, or row or column to uh, basically reappear. Okay. Yeah. And can I land on the same um, space as another player? No. Uh, okay. I'll, it's a really small, narrow okay. passageway. Okay, well, I'll but, go yeah. this way. Okay. And then what happens to the pit? Um, Does it disappear? Yes. So now that there's nothing illuminating those tiles, we're going to lose them. All of them? The ones that are not illuminated. So Lauren, myself, and Bruno are illuminating tiles. Those are All gone. of them? Yep. Holy moly. Yeah. So we just place them here so we can keep track. Okay, so we have a straight line, this one, and the X's. This one is a starting tile, so that goes there. So we have four starting tiles. There's two of them in there. And just to give a little closer look at what we're doing here. And then where does the cross go? Uh, same, same spot as those, yeah. This is all for like the basic shapes. Wow. Okay. <laughs> feel all lonely over there. Yeah, so also, Michelle, you are now lights out. And uh. what happens with lights out, friends, is you have your player card to just turn this over now. Michelle's lights out. Uh, she's been scared. Um, so you now you cannot stay anywhere. You always have to move. And what's interesting about the lights out, you can get you can get your lights back in by being adjacent to another uh, player with a candle okay. to relight your candle. Okay. But until then, you only illuminate one square ahead of you. Ooh. Yeah, you do not illuminate around you. That is very large. Uh, yeah. So basically, when you're oh. deciding when to come back, uh, try to get close Whoa. to uh, me or um, uh, Lauren. Hey, we yeah. got a bunch of gifts. Let's take a quick uh, gift uh, break. Um, thank you, TVivD, for the gifts. We much appreciated. Uh, friends, we do analog alerts here, and whenever we get gifts, uh, we tell you that there's an alert we have five new gift subscriptions thanks to our friend and supporter tvivd thank you so much tvivd these gifts are for you friends let's go gift 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 thanks tvivd so happy you're here let's get back to the game shall we Woo! all right uh appreciate that gift. it is lauren's turn i've been waiting for this ah Lauren got the first key, folks. Yes. <laughs> Did they also do that in Ted Lasso? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. Um, so. Do I do I like keep the key here? Is what? Keep you can it? keep it on your board. Yeah. Okay. I still get to illuminate. Yes. Stuff. First, but let's take away stuff. This stuff goes away. Okay. Um, but maybe I do. So another start tile and then another X. Okay. So Lauren, do I stay there so I can keep this lit up so you can go there? Because. So I can go here? You eventually have. That's. Well, I. Yeah, yeah. Because eventually all four of us have to have a key and go to a gate. Oh. There are there are three more gate tiles. So if I lose if we lose that one, there we may be able to. Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm the only one with the key. I think it's early enough where you can still sacrifice it. Okay. Cool. Um, yeah. T Vivi says I'm here for the analog alerts. Thank you, <laughs> T Vivi. We we love doing them. Um, okay. So I shall go. If I go, we gotta help Bruno. Bruno's stuck there. What Bruno you? just has to go down the whole. Yeah, I think Bruno's just gonna have to jump in the pit. Sorry, Bruno. Um, okay. So I guess we're gonna leave. Uh, it's my turn. So I'm... oh wait, no. no, it is Lauren's turn. It is Lauren's turn. Yeah. No, it's, it's Bruno. Bruno's turn. My bad. Ah. Okay. So Bruno's so in the pit. Bruno's in the pit, and so goes over. What, what do you think? Here or here? Uh, yeah. Go ahead there because yeah, because uh, you actually have the entire row or column that you're in. Okay. okay, that's the starter tile. Thank you. And that one is going to be gone. And the, the monster wax. as well. <laughs> what do I call it the wax monster? Wax, it's a wax eater. Wax eater, because they eat candle wax, folks. But it still counts as an attack, <laughs> right? Does that still count as an attack? 
attack triggers, move within line sight, uh, pit empty, attack all four directions. Yeah, were lightsabers on the um, candy thing? You know what? No, we totally Ooh. forgot about those. Oh. Lightsabers would be, I think they would have got done well in the candy tournament. Who, who'd y'all have in the candy tournament? I had stickers, of course. Michelle, who did you have? Reese's? Well, it wasn't candy corn. <laughs> But yes, recess would have been my my next um, thing to vote for. Yeah. Speaking of, can I have a Reese's peanut butter cup? My oh. sticker from my pumpkin spice latte is wearing off. <laughs> <laughs> yes, let me take the lifesaver first. So before this, um, before our stream, I went okay, to a party <laughs> and because my friend's daughter graduated from nursing school, and she had all these like things. Well, here, lifesavers. You know, they were. Uh, oh, the monster nursing. just killed off one of our games. Oh, they oh were shoot! Nursing themed. She had these little, you know, they're <laughs> filled with um, lemon drops. I love lemon drops. Yeah. Oh, that, that's oh, so that's funny. It's, it's, uh, it's funny that they did the yellow thing for the. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's like the urine cup. Yeah. 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 I'll take one, please. Yeah. <laughs> you know. Thanks. Yeah, I was surprised. Urine. Mike was talking about how you know if lemon heads would have been on the candy bracket. I'd that probably would have went far too. Really? I like them in a lot. I don't like them better than Reese's. Oh, I'm talking about the fruit side of the. There was a chocolate side of the bracket and a fruit side. Oh, yeah. oh, I didn't know. Oh yeah, I had to, I forgot to show you. All right, so friends, how about y'all? What candies were you rooting for in the tournament? Okay, so Bruno just went. Uh, it is now my turn. So we've lost one gate. We're gonna probably lose another one here unless I go there. Here. I can illuminate this. Okay, I'm going to go here oh. just to keep the gate. Just yeah. um, this is going to be gone. This is going to be gone. Oh. This one is oh. gone. Okay, so we lost a bunch of these. I'm going to illuminate two. Man, another stupid monster. Don't call him names. going to get mad. Okay, I'll do this. Okay. Okay, now it is back to Michelle. Okay. So Michelle is lights out right now. She can only move um, a space, and then she only gets one um, illuminated. Top. Oh, this is uh, you're coming back from the pit, right? Yeah. Okay. Oh, Bruno's going to take off from the studio. Bye, Bruno. He needs to take a break from yeah. chewing on the high tree. <laughs> <laughs> so what do I do? Uh, let me... Uh, Got the rulebook here just to make sure we're doing this correctly. So I may spend a nerve. Mm -hmm. to move no, no, no. Oh. So from wherever you are, mm -hmm. um, you may place your prisoner token along the edge, either by the edge of the row or column you just occupied. Um, we already discarded any tiles. Start your next turn. Choose an empty, unlit space along the row or column you choose. Draw a tile to land upon and place your prisoner upon it. So anywhere in that row or column. Really? Yep. I want to stay away from the stay away from the monster. Monster, yep. okay. So how about if I go here? Okay. okay, and then just draw a tile. If you go next to me, though, does it help me? Oh, anything? yeah. Then I can um, yeah go light my candle. Oh, it has to be empty, unlit space though. Empty, unlit. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But so hey, now, yeah. Now you. Oh, and so if I move here. Then... Yep. Okay. I place a tile uh, right? underneath your uh, character. Yeah. Yes. Did you grab one for me, please? No monster. Oh, Bruno's back. No monster. No, no, it is not a monster. What is it? A key. Oh, a key. Perfect. Yay, oh, how perfect is that? Nice. So you land on a key, you just take it. Oh, okay. It doesn't even need to yep. sit there. Okay. Yeah, you take your turn as normal. So you this is like a double? Uh, so the first part of the turn is coming back from the pit, and then now you're taking your turn. Oh, so. okay. Like, welcome back. Welcome okay. back, yeah. Oh, so no. first move, and then... Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So cool. With two keys, folks. Well, I'm going to go over here. Okay. So I still just get one tile. Yep. Well, do that, I guess. Okay, cool. Oh, and I move my... No, no, you're still there. No. You just Because okay. you already moved, you've lit up. Now, because you're next to Lauren, who has a candle, she lights your candle. You are now no longer lights up. You can flip over. I can see. Mm-hmm. Jow says, great, come back from the pit. Hopefully Bruno can do the same. 
Okay, so now it is Lauren's turn. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, Mom kind of leaves lit up. Um, if I go here, it only lights up this one. Mm -hmm. So maybe I'll loop here. So I don't lose any tiles. Mm -hmm. Oh, actually, then we'll lose the one to the right here because it's not lit by me because it's not connected. Oh, uh, I feel like that's okay. I'll yep. probably connect something here anyway. Yep. Oh, oh wow! Ooh. Am I the luckiest person alive? Two yes. keys, yes. Oh, but you can only carry one key. Right? Yeah. Wait, so that one. Oh, but does not go I forgot, there. Bruno. Huh? That one, because is there a connector? Is that a? Oh, my bad. Yeah, yeah, you're good. Oh. Actually, it'll be three. Because this is a uh, cross. One here, one here, and one on the other side of the board. Cool, cool, cool. You can go ahead and grab those keys and place them there, please. And you can only carry one key at a time, right? Correct. Okay, so I can't grab So you. that's actually good for me, because I'll be able to get a key on my turn. Yeah. But first, Bruno needs to come back from the pit. Okay. So any, uh, he was in that column or that row. So... Put him close to us. Right here? Where, where did he? He was. Uh, he, he was up here. It, 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 this is the pit, right? Yeah. So he can go anywhere in this row or this row, any of the spaces. So I'm thinking if he comes closer to us, it'll be easier for him to get a key. Like all the way. Oh. Okay. Oh yeah yeah. Right. Okay. Okay. Bruno Bruins. Foster the Meeple's hi. Foster the Meeple, good to see you on here. Okay. Now Bruno gets to move. Lauren, show you do the honors. Ah. Dun, da, da, da. Yeah, and Bruno yeah. back the he was actually lights out. I forgot to flip over his card, oh. but okay, he has a key. But now he's next to Lauren, so lights back on. Yay! Yay. Lauren, you bring light to all those around you. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, Ajao says where Goran was before was fractured. Goran was yeah. Uh, you moved okay. up, so yeah, so that just flips around. You already got the key, oh. but it flips around to a pit now. Good looking out, Zhao. Appreciate that. Okay. Yeah, put some love for uh, Foster Meeple. They got a great YouTube channel. Thanks for joining us today. Ooh. And then uh, TVD says, shouldn't the tile to the left of yellow have disappeared because it's not lit? Yes. So you are correct. Thank you, TVD. Yeah. Because it's not lit, because uh, it's not connected by me. You gotta watch us. Yeah, y'all are great. <laughs> great job, chat. So we've lost a lot of basic ones so far. Uh, the key tiles, I don't think we've lost any yet. But we've gotten a... So Michelle has a key, Lord has a key, and Bruno... Okay, so I'm the only one that doesn't have a key yet. But you're really close. And, oh, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, man, can we win this game? Yeah. Wow. Okay. We must celebrate by eating candy corn. Yes. Well, wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> Candy corn. Um, it's my turn, right? Yes. Okay, I'm going to move up. That triggers this attack, but they are not attacking anyone because no one's in this uh, row or column. Aha, uh -huh, earwax. Take that earwax. <laughs> and then, and it's no longer illuminated. Bye bye, monster. Um, this one is no longer illuminated. That's uh, another one there. So I've got to draw one, two. Uh, X, the T. Um, we'll do this one here. This one, like so. Okay. And um, I think that's my turn. First time chatter. Celebrate by eating candy. Oh. That sounds more like a punishment. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> First time chatter. Thank you for joining us, Spectre. Yeah, that's. Uh, we have a. Um, we have a divide in our household. Uh, I am no, candy corn boo. Michelle is candy corn yay. It, Lauren, where do, Gorin, where do you fall on candy corn? Yay? No. Uh, okay. So the boos have it. It's an acquired taste. It is an acquired taste. When yeah. I was four. <laughs> <laughs> I used to love candy corn, but now. Nice. Uh, well, now you've graduated to pumpkin spice latte. <laughs> <laughs> Fox people said, can't wait to get our copy, have a copy on this. Yeah, it, it's it's really good. Hope you all are enjoying the creepy music, too. Um, my turn is over. It's back to Michelle. Okay, so I am here. Um, 
So at this point, I'm going to get that fourth key, and mm -hmm. I need to get to that um, gate right here. Here's the thing. If I go to get this key, this one goes away. Right <coughs> here. So I need to stay there for now to illuminate it. Okay, what if I'll move there on my turn? Okay. So it really doesn't matter where I move it. <laughs> you need to start moving <coughs> to where the gate. Yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, so we've got some Nova Scotians in the house. <laughs> Sydney in the house. All right. Oh, that's right. Yeah, why that plays in Korea. Our Korean uh, uh, friends. <laughs> Excuse me. Did you guys see the Thanksgiving dinner candy corn from Brock's that's supposed to be available at Walgreens? Black. So I have not seen that. Here? Doesn't sound good. Though. Uh, oh, wait. Isn't this also... Because someone took the key from this already, so isn't yeah. it supposed to flip to a pit? I think it's when you move away from it or onto it. Or, I mean, away from it, right? So I don't know if it should be a pit. So... Maybe it is. Yeah, you know what? Let's play it safe. Let, let's say it is a pit, right? Yeah? Here. Yeah. So, again, if you, if you end your turn on a pit, then you are going to fall in there. Okay. So yeah. if I fall in that pit, though, I can go in... This row, or this column, or this row. Correct. Um, uh, empty space. You might as well fall into the upper pit then. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that would make more sense if you're still falling in. Michelle. Okay. So I'm in the pit. Okay. Okay, and this goes away. Yeah, so basically, you just take this off and then. Oh, okay. Uh, that's yeah. going to stay illuminated because uh, Lawrence is right next to it. Oh, okay. But this one goes. Correct. And this one goes. Correct. And does this pick go too? Correct. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What is this? This is a king tile. But then I can choose a tile and put it here and here? Uh, no. So your turn is over now. On your next turn, you're going to choose. Bruno. Okay. Got it. Got it. Yeah. Nice. Okay. So Bruno's turn. Bruno Bruins. So now Bruno's got a key. Where is Bruno? Right here. Okay. Want to move him? Yeah, towards the gate. Okay, so just yep. there. Yep. to yep. the right, to the right. Okay. Okay, so then now the fractured pieces will flip, or that fractured piece will flip, and then the other one goes away because it's not illuminated anymore. With this one? Yep. Okay, so the straight ones, that goes right there. Okay, so his turn's done. Uh, yeah. Oh, wait, I didn't go. Oh, yeah, you're before Bruno, huh? Yeah, oh, but okay. it doesn't matter, I guess, because I would have just. Um, right there. True. So I guess there should be a tile here, which is not useful at all. Um, <laughs> yep. Okay. okay. So now it's everything is even, so we start a new yep. rotation. Cool, cool, cool. Lauren, and can we retcon that your move? What's that mean? Oh, oh like. Redo it. Oh, actually, no. If you stay there, see, because we can't go through spaces with other prisoners. Because oh, we're no. digging tunnels and stuff, and I want to get that key. Actually, yeah. So if I just fall down the hole, but can I be here? Uh, you would fall down that pit, just like your mom. But you would have to. You'd come in on a, on a different. Oh, like, this I... column. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's just okay. an indicator where you're gonna go. So that's what. Justin, why didn't back. Bruno have a tile to his left, on the other side? That might have been before we moved in. Yeah. Okay. You can trade keys as well. Yeah, you could you could give keys okay. if you're adjacent. But yeah, no one's adjacent to it yet. Okay, here's what I'm afraid of. Uh, so it's my turn again, right, Lauren? Yes. Okay, so Lauren is lights out and Michelle's lights out. Um, go ahead and flip over your player aid. Um, I need to, I want that key, but then we're going to lose that gate if I move. We've got one gate gone. There are a total of four gates. Oh, oh. So there's two more gates in our candle here. What do I do, friends? Do I lose the key or do I, I, I want to get that key. I think you should stay. Or I can stay. It's a choir and nerve. And then when I move, or when mom or I moves here, then I can go keep there. keep the gate here. Good call. All right. Lauren got it, folks. She says... Hey, oops, um, I was not lights out. Oh, why that point also says I could pass you the key and pick up the one in my space. 
Oh, so, so, okay, so recon again. Yep. If I was here, then I could pass you one key. Your key. Oh, perfect. Oh, thank you, why that play. That's perfect. Okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and retcon that. Okay, so Lauren, instead of falling down the pit, she's giving her the key that she had in her possession to me. It's a free action. And then, another free action, she is picking up the key that she just stumbled upon. And she's done this one already, that's right. I think I did this. Her nose working hard on this. <laughs> she is chewing away. That one down there will disappear because it's no longer being illuminated. Thank you. And then I have I have a key. I am gonna so, go. Well, all four of us have a key. So we need to get to that gate. I'm gonna go there first. Boom. I have my key. This goes away. It's no longer illuminated. And that's the end of my turn. So one of us is there. We need to get everyone else. We got three more folks. Um, How am I gonna get there? I know. Oh, should I have? Or you could go here. Yeah, it has to be an empty spot. Oh, so you cannot go. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Yeah. Okay. 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 Yep. Yeah. All right. Put that under yours. Oh, it's another gate. Oh. oh. But we have to be on the same gate. Oh. Yeah. So okay. now you take your turn as normal. Okay, so I, I place tiles there. Yes. Okay. Could you pass me three, please? Okay. Our candle's burning. Candle's burning, so we're getting close, oh. folks. Uh Ruel needs to draw tiles in the lower pit. Oh, that's right. Thank you. Room. Yeah. This one. I was supposed to draw this top one. Oh, should Ooh. I should I go back then? Uh yeah. yeah. So uh okay, so this one's actually still lit. Because mom is there, question mark? Yep. Or, okay. Okay. And this is not drawn. So I'm going to shuffle these that we have here. Thanks for keeping us on our toes there, folks. Keeping us honest. Um, so now I'm supposed to draw two, correct? To light the ones around me? Yeah, this one and this one. Okay. Drawing two. It is another gate and a T. So I'm going to put the T here. And then the... Uh, the gate here. Okay, now it's Michelle's turn. Okay, so... She's coming back from the pit. So I can go here. Yep. Actually, Ruel, I think you should have put this one here. Uh, it has to be connected to the tile oh, that I'm oh. on. Yeah. So I'm going to go here. Okay. Oh, oh no, it's a monster. monster. So you immediately get hit. Okay, so... Oh, I'm on lights off. And you're um, still on, you're still I'm lights, still out. On lights out. Yeah, but the monster will discard three of these tiles. Okay, so am I like over here again? Um, I think if you stay on the monster, let me check. Oh, I don't want to stay with the monster. Uh, if you land on a monster, um, land on a monster. I keep calling it earwax monster. <laughs> I think you're the wax, was it? Wax eater. Wax eater. <laughs> wax eater, not earwax monster. Okay. So it immediately do an attack. Um, after the attack, the following prisoner scrambles to an adjacent space, either an existing tile or a newly drawn one. Oh. Uh, yeah, go okay. closer. Right. Oh, and then why that place says Ruel also gets hit. Yeah, I do, oh. because it's connected. So that's uh, going to be another three. Uh, one, two, uh, three. Oh. Uh, and I go lights out. Okay. That's okay. I'm just sticking around, building up my nerves. <laughs> Thank you, Team Empty. Your wax. It's easier to remember. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. Uh, it is Lauren's turn, correct? No. Yes. Lauren the Bruno. Yeah. Yes. Oh, we gotta, let me show what we discarded. Oh. We lost another key, which doesn't matter. Oh, we did lose a monster, the earwax. <laughs> we lost another earwax, but we lost another gate. And then we lost another one of those guys. We're all so close. Okay, so Lauren, go ahead and take out the ones that are not being illuminated. Please, okay. thank you. And I think that the straight line that's going down is it's not connected to the tile I'm on. Oh, oh. Thank you. Okay, now it's our uh, ready. It's tricky for me to, to figure out. Yeah, that's what I like about this. I, I really like the way the tile placement is uh, done in this game. Okay, uh, Bruno Bruno, our pug, is running around in the night cage. And then this actually flipped, right? Because you moved, right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, if your light's out, don't you lose the tiles around Buell, including the gate? 
If I'm lights out. Oh. That's a good question. I I don't. I think it's when I move. I mean, I don't. Lo if I stay, I'm good. Right? Because I haven't moved yet. Is it my turn? No, it's Bruno's. Turn. Okay, it's Bruno's turn. We're trying to figure out if we, uh, if your lights out, don't you lose the tile around the tiles around the well? Um, I don't know. It says you can stay even though you. Yeah. Your lights out gain no nerve. Yeah, you gain no nerve, and you move when you move. You illuminate only one tile rather than all the tiles around you. And then I'm gonna relight anyways because oh, wait, is anyone? No, we're all lights out. Yeah. Except for Bruno. So Bruno needs to go next to Lauren, so we can start a chain reaction um, light uh, relighting. Okay. Let's move Bruno to that X, please. Okay. Okay. Now we take out this one because it's not illuminated. Which was the key. Bruno is lit next to Lauren. Lauren, your candle lights up. I am next to Lauren. My candle lights up. I'm next to you. Oh, oh, we can see it again. We can see it again. Hello, family. Yeah. Bruno. Oh, uh, Zhao says, yeah, when you get hit, the gate below. Not the towel you are on. Your, your lights out, though, you lose the gate below. When you get hit. Oh, when I get hit, that one should be gone? Okay, yeah. It's so. Below. Okay, cool. But thanks to Bruno, the pug saved our day. He just, we, I, you know, you just imagine Bruno, he lights a candle that I like, or the Lauren lights are. Oh, and he, he can't out to take a nap. <laughs> he can't hold a candle. <laughs> He's too busy gnawing on the hype train. <laughs> He's taking a nap right now, taking a break. <laughs> Bruno saves the day. Yes. Right? Oh, yeah. Okay. So now Bruno has to eliminate near him. So two. It really doesn't matter. Yeah. Crypto, I some Bruno fans and Bruno treat. Yeah, mm -hmm. Bruno deserves a treat. Thank you, Bruno, for saving the day. Yeah. Okay. Well, Foster and the Meagle says 1 a.m. here. Bet is calling. Wanted to stop in and say hi and show some support. Good luck with the game. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Foster and Have a great night. Thank you so much. We got another treat coming in from our friend Why That Play. Bruno knows he deserves treats after that move. So now it's my sure. turn, right? Yes. I'm going to stay and gain one nerve. Can you have me a nerve, please? Again, our your limit is two. I have two nerve, and you can spend that to either block a monster attack, uh, charge onto a monster, um, or sustain during the final flicker. Final flicker is uh, when we're out of tiles here, which we're getting sort of close to, but I think we're safe right now. So I'm going to stay, um, and uh, that's it. Okay, so I can move. Yep. So I will move here. Yep. Now here's the thing. Because you moved, um, that monster is going to attack us. Anyway. Should I not move there? No, you have to move there because that's the end of the game. <laughs> okay. So let's do the attack. So attack is, we are both lights out. Okay. Each attack is three. I'm going to spend one of my nerves. So instead of three, discard two only. And then... So if I do the same. Oh, uh, why the play? Uh, isn't the monster removed after? Uh, so it triggers. You get the effects of the attack, and then you remove the monster because it's not illuminated. And then these are the tiles that we lose. Yeah, another monster. Ooh, and another monster got lucky. <laughs> okay, and then Michelle, you are in the spot too. Yeah, we're good. Let's. Any other tiles that need to be removed? No, and also like, wouldn't you get to lay down two more tiles? Uh, oh, that's where your mom went, right? Well, yeah. both of you, but yeah. yeah. Don't monster, please. There is a key. Okay. Well, it doesn't really matter, huh? Yeah. Okay. Well, that's the Just fifth because. And final. And then I move. Yay. I just need to get Bruno. Come on, Bruno. It's too busy taking a nap. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Go ahead and get rid of the other stuff. Uh oh. Uh oh. One final monster. And then... Run, Bruno, run! I think we got this, friends. T oh. <laughs> why am I biting my nails and not even playing? No, <laughs> you're right there with us, T D. Thank you. Oh, so doesn't is Bruno attacked by the monster? 
Inferno? Yeah, because oh, that's no right. Monsters yeah. There. So. Well, he if the monster just appeared, it will. So we're all gonna stay, right? Yes. Mm-hmm. But the thing is, we stay. Um. Is anyone lights out? I am. Okay, your lights out. You. Should I turn that over? Yeah, because you're with us now. Okay. We we I'm... all yeah we live okay. can. Okay. Um. So I'm gonna stay. And uh, I collect a nerve. And then do when we're stained, I don't remember if we take uh, drop discard a tile or not. I think it's only when you are uh, your turn ends. Discard a tile. Discard a tile and gain one nerve. Okay, so I forgot to discard a tile when I got my other nerve, so I'm gonna discard two just as a makeup. Uh, they are both these. Okay. And then it is Michelle's turn. I'm gonna stay. Okay. Grab a nerve. And then discard a tile. Okay. Lauren. Turn nerve and tile. Okay. Okay. Bruno's final move. He is gonna move away and join us in the gate. It, will, it does count as an attack because of that monster. So they're going to give away three of these tiles or discard three. Mm-hmm. And then go ahead and remove any tiles that are not illuminated, including the monster. Woohoo! Yes. And friends, we have done it. We did it. Wow. Yay. Yay. Candy corn for everyone. Yeah. Oh, we did yes. it. We did it. Huzzah. Wow. <laughs> wow. 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 We were very fortunate with the tiles that we drew. Yeah. I, I felt like when Lauren got that double key or whatever, that was that was key to victory. <laughs> See what I did there? T fifty is gift of the sub. Thank you so much for the gift, T fifty. Appreciate it. You know, let's give another gift uh, alert. Oh so. my gosh, T fifty has given forty five gift subs to oh, this channel. Amazing! Woo! Thank you. Forty six. Yeah, thank you, T fifty. Friends, we do have log alerts here. Oh, these are all out of order, but thank you. Uh, alert, alert. We have a, more gift subs. Thanks to our friend t -Viv -D. Thank you so much, t -Viv -D. And we, you know what we do when we have gifts? Gift, 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 gift. And also, Spectre is also gifted one to Panda Angel. Thank you, Spectre. Woo! Alert, alert. Another gift sub. Thank you, Spectre. Thank you, our gift sub. So we say gift, gift, gift. Thank you so much, friends. I uh, this game is so much fun. What a cool way to do a, the mechanism tile lane. You know, you're laying tiles, but you're also taking away a bunch. Mm. Wow, it's it's got that spooky vibe too. I, I'm like the whole like yeah, I don't like it's totally creepy on here. Right? We got these little monsters or humans or you know prisoners. Those are prisoners. Up. Yeah, we're trying to get out, right? <laughs> We're not looking so good in here. Yeah, look at this thing. And just they're, yeah. Look how scary that is. They're like crouched over. Yeah. Oh, my <laughs> oh my goodness. Um. It does look creepy. It does, yeah. Awesome, folks. Um, you know what? We've got some more. Now we can play this again. And ramp up the difficulty. There are uh, things that you can add to uh, ramp up the difficulty and stuff. What we're gonna do? I think. Why don't we do this? Why don't we uh, play another? Quick game of this, and um, if we have time, we'll play uh, another game from Spark and Death. Okay. Like okay, so Sounds what we're going to do uh, is going to uh, do a little uh, cleanup here, and we'll let you see how we do the uh, things here. So the starter tiles will go back to us. One, two, three, four. We'll get all the keys back there, the gates. Uh, for starting, um, you need two crosses, four T's. One, two, three. Two crosses, yes. four T's, and one straight one. Everything else will be um, shuffled up Start into the deck. Let's we'll shuffle all of these, or I'll shuffle all of these. Okay. <laughs> TBMD, I would go down to my game room to get my copy of the rule book, but now I'm scared to go down there. <laughs> <laughs> well, send Bruno over there to save you. Okay. Is this supposed to be out? Uh, no, that was it. These are the starter tiles. I'll keep these here. Oh, wait. These starter tiles should be out. Uh -oh. All four of them? Yeah, there should be four. Okay. Of those are our starters. So find the ones that look like this. I thought they were in like one little pile. 
Okay, so not this one. Any of these? Here's one. Oops. They might be next to each other. There. See some gates here. Oh, here's one. There's another. There's three. Okay, four. Perfect. Okay, just leave those there. These are the starters, and then mm -hmm. now you can shuffle all those. <laughs> Victor says, just bring your camel with you. That's <laughs> you, Get uh, a friend. It needs to go out. And a friend, yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. Folks, don't forget, uh, right after this, we've got about an hour, and we're going to raid um, board game Spam. And they're playing a, a game. Uh, what are they? Oh, they're playing Bass, the Mysterious Manor. And from what I understand, um, they made some treats the other day that were bath uh, themed. So I'm looking forward to seeing what uh, Pia and Andrew came up with to uh, do on the stream. It's going to be a lot of fun. Um, we're going to run back the Night Cage, friends, and hopefully we'll get we'll see if we're as lucky as we were before. I felt like we had a good draw there, and um, we'll, we shall see. So we're going to run back, uh, load up the candle, and hey, friends in chat. Yeah, anyone got uh, what are your favorite towel laying games? We we love towel layers here in our household. Um, this is one of our favorites. Uh, we love um, oh, what are the other towel? Kohaku. Layers? Kohaku is good, that was really beautiful. good. Yeah, oh my gosh, Kohaku is one of the, it's like the total opposite of this, right? Yeah. It's so dark <laughs> and creepy. Perhaps we need to play that. <laughs> yeah, and Kohaku is like absolutely just gorgeous, it's beautiful, got little fish and flowers and stuff. Uh, Glenmore 2, I have not played Glenmore 2 yet. Uh, TV, yeah, classic Carcassonne. I love that game as well. We actually have the Star Wars edition Carcassonne that we got from Japan, which we I, I still enjoy. Of course, I mean Star Wars. Of course, I enjoy it. Uh, let's see. Uh, jalapeno. Hey, Jalapeno. Botanic. I don't. We have not played Botanic yet. How was that? Well, what other tile? I know there's other tile layers that we. Cascadia, one of our favorites this year. And let's get going. Let's we're gonna jump right into it again, folks. Uh, we'll keep the same turn order. Um, here's your starters. Here's Bruno's starter. We have our candles. Uh, this starter. There's the starter there. Gracias. Okay. And then I draw a tile. I'll do it this way. And there we go. Starbucks 7660. Oh, hey Starbucks. Uh, this looks so, yeah, it's really cool. We really enjoyed it. Oops, sorry, Lauren. Calico cool. was great, but I also liked Suburbia. Oh, yeah, yeah. Suburbia is another Suburbia. good one. And Calico is, is... Brain burning. So, yeah. <laughs> but we were comparing that to Cascadia, right? Yeah. How, but, like, with, um, Calico, you're so limited in your space, whereas yeah. in Cascadia, you can branch out. Yeah. I really love Cassie. I love them both, but... Okay, uh, Michelle, go ahead and place your oh, starter. I had never realized you had already okay. done yours. I'm sitting here waiting. Oh, Tor, Victor says, uh, Lanterns. Yeah, I love Lanterns. Mm, I've not yeah. played that in a while. Ooh, Gentle Rain. I heard really good things about that, Xiao. I have not gotten a copy of that yet. Isn't that a... Prince? No, that's... Purple Rain. Purple Rain. <laughs> Purple rain. Gentle rain. Yeah, it's like the same number of like syllables. <laughs> Santa Monica is a really good game too. Oh yeah, I we haven't played, played that. that. Wow. Yeah, hmm. why that play has Cascadia coming next week? Yes, uh, you're gonna love it. We that's one of my favorites of this year. Top ten, top five, for up there. Okay. Um, just got the mini expansion. Oh, you got the mini oh, expansion for Santa Monica. Nice. Lauren has earwax. Oh no. Okay, Ooh. this may be the opposite of the last game. Uh, now it is Bruno's turn. <laughs> Lauren, you want to move for Bruno? Oh, sure. Um, wow, they're not messing. This one game's not messed around. Ooh, King Domino's a classic. Yes. Oh, okay. So maybe they just didn't get mixed up very well. Wow, I guess not. Okay. But it's too late now. Yeah. So we may be losing this one quickly. Victor, have you played King Domino Origins? It's really good. It's a new one. I don't know if it's out yet, uh, but it's like King Domino, like next level. Really, really like that. Okay. Wow, we're in trouble, folks. Uh, I'm going to go. I'm going to move down, please. And I light up two tiles. Um, let's see. Do it this way so we block off that one. Oh, actually, but you're here. Which is fine. I'm just going to be sick. You're gonna sacrifice, okay? Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> All right, and to Michelle. 
girls were left hungry from the last game. <laughs> Obviously they were. Alright. Um, yeah. Okay, I will just move here. And I'm gonna need two tiles, please. Ooh, that Hershey's cookies and cream was like super sweet. <laughs> Hmm. There should not be monsters in the initial draw. Oh, that's right. Yeah, you're right. Start we, over. Uh, let's take those monsters out. Um, I totally. I, okay. What I should have done. Actually, well, yeah. All the tiles that we place, we're gonna retcon the entire thing. Okay. Except for your starters. Just go ahead and put oh. your starters there. Because well, I'll shuffle these. Any other tiles? I had the starters right here. I forgot to put them in. Wow, yeah, I was going to say that was brutal. <laughs> Game over. Okay, so we already know there's going to be a mon bunch of monsters coming out. But, yeah, we do this. These will be safe. Um, I'll do this. Here, this here. Okay, and then Michelle, which one are you? Um, green. Two of them. Two. And then Lauren. Oops. And then Bruno. Much better. Yeah. Woo! Yeah, you folks were dead in the dark on that one. Yeah, right. We were talking. Somebody got out the Q-tip. <laughs> <laughs> That's for Bruno. Thanks, Griptop. Appreciate that. Uh, Tabletops. Hey, I missed it. What is Bruno dressing up as for Halloween? Oh, friends. Uh, I don't know. Uh, Panda is uh, Amanda Panda. Have we announced what's happening for the after party? That's all I'm gonna. I'm just gonna ask that question. I may have spoiled it already, but are we? Have, I don't know if we've announced anything for the after party. Bruno has many costumes. He does. And he doesn't appreciate it at Bruno all. Bruno does not like costumes. <laughs> However, he does like going to In N Out and getting a puppy patty, which we did today. <laughs> Bruno gets puppy patties. They are unsalted meat patties, uh, no dressing or anything like that. The workers, uh, the employees at uh, In Out love Bruno. <laughs> Okay, so we've done one full round, correct? Yes, yes. Okay, back to me. I'm going to move. You've got to move it. Got to move, move it. it, move it. This one flips, and this one goes away. This one flips over. And then I get two there. Tabletop sardined Bruno fan. Bruno fan! I think Bruno was a little too hyped up from the hype train, so yeah, he's I'm out now. Tired. <laughs> Okay, back to Michelle. Okay, so Cortis in the house. I'm gonna move here so I get one, two, three. Table tots, uh, you're a Bruno fan. We're gonna let you walk our dog. Thanks for walking. Did you really walk him? <laughs> <laughs> He's so funny. <laughs> He's just the sweetest boy. Back in the old days, five for five dollars at my Arby's. My dogs loved it. <laughs> oh, I love Arby's. Michelle, that is her jam. She loves Arby's. There's not one that's like really close to us. Yeah. So we don't have it very often. Yeah. Um, um, oh, no, that doesn't go there. It goes, uh, where, where, what tiles did you lay down? That this one? This one. Okay. No, so I, it just connects to what you're on. So this, oh. and this, yeah. Wait, how did I get another one? Let's do. Okay, and then that starting space you moved off will flip over to a pit. Okay, so doesn't this one go, go away? away. Yep. The other ones are cool. Yep. All right, Lauren. This one's moved here, so we will make it. One thingy. Mm -hmm. uh, I think I hope the other one goes away eventually and gets replaced. Let's take one. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. Now Bruno. Go, Bruno, go. Bruno, Bruno's purple? Yes. Yep. Oh, did he not move? Oh, what? What did I do? Oh, shoot. Okay. Did so, you move? It's hard playing for two players. <laughs> I know. We, we should be helping you out. Sorry. Um, Oops. Um, so it doesn't really matter where he goes because he can't lay anything down. Yeah. Because there's no. Yeah. Okay. We'll just so, play like that. We'll just go there. Okay. Yay. Put that over, then throw away with tile. Uh, this one. Sorry, Bruno. Okay. 
Cool. Hey, Starbucks, thanks for cheering the bits. Appreciate it. Folks, if you're new to the channel, you spend bits. Benny in the bits for shows up. Hello. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Starbucks, for all the bits. Much appreciated. Let's see if these characters can get out and escape from the Night Cage. Oh, shoot. Wait, so what did I just play? Oh, I didn't play anything. Yeah, so I you, you shouldn't be in trouble. Um, uh, but I didn't. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're making up. We're making up for lost uh, moves there. So now we are okay. Um, Michelle said um, Lauren needs a tile to her left. Yeah. Yeah, so that, that was. Yeah, it goes oh, oh, gotcha. Yeah. Gotcha. Thank you. Okay. Uh, so it's my turn. Do I want to move into that? So if I go here, I'm gonna block you, Lauren. Uh, yes. Okay, so I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna take one for the team. Are, do you want to fall in the pit? Because you're gonna get attacked by that monster. Why don't you move to the right? To the right, to the right, okay. We don't really, yeah, we don't yeah. really have, like, a, yeah. Okay. We don't Ooh. have a gate yet, a key. Oh, but oh, we have your wax. Yep, okay, back to Michelle. Oh. What if? Okay. <laughs> So if I put something here, well, I have to move here, and then that's going to put me near the earwax. And that monster will trigger because you moved it there, so you would get hit, I would get hit. Well, that doesn't sound good. Right? <laughs> Not at all. Um, if I move here, I'm going to fall in the pit. Mm -hmm. But do I still get to place three tiles or no? Uh, yes, but then they're going to go away anyway. If you will place three tiles, you'll fall in the pit, but then everything oh, will go is away. Gone. Got yeah, it. Okay. Yeah. So if I go to here, I'm going to go to this um, space that is crackling. I, I can't. Oh, no, I can place something here. Yep. I guess. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do that. but then when you end your turn on that crackle, it's going to turn over and become a pit. I don't know, I don't know. Help yeah. me out, chat. <laughs> yeah. What do y'all think? Uh, Dallas is up or uh, pit. Yeah, on the next turn, you'll be, you'll be okay. Okay, so yeah. I should go up then? Yeah. Okay. So move there. And then I get a pile. Okay, and it's that. Okay. Uh oh, I did that. Okay, so this goes away anyway, right? Yep. This and this. Okay. Okay, so this was a starter, and this was that. Now that crumbling tile that you're on, it says crumbling tiles collapse into pits the turn mm -hmm. after you step on it. Okay. okay. So the next turn, um, that's going to turn into a pit. I gotta be careful. But you will run away anyway. Oh, so. well, yeah, so I'll be over here. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Lauren. I'm going here. And I also can't lay anything down. Uh, on the other side. Just kidding. <laughs> this is a starter. Oh, dear. Okay, this one is Lauren. Yeah, we'll Thank you. I pulled another monster. Another monster. Cheerwax. Yeah, okay. Uh, Bruno's turn. So Bruno, he can go into the pit or up above. If he goes up above, he's going to trigger that monster. So I say he goes in the pit, takes one for the team. Oh, this goes away now, right? Oh, yeah. Oh. I always forget that. And one of the earwax on the right goes away. Yep. Oh, and that's Thank what you, you did. Thank okay. you, Dog. Grip Dog's on top of this one. Appreciate Excellent. it. Actually, everyone in chat has been fantastic. Thank you all. Um, yeah, let's... Bruno, sorry, you're going to go to the pit with the hype train. Okay. It's okay, he needs some privacy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so he falls off the board. Okay. So, where so, can he come? Should I... Where should we put him? So, this goes away, right? Yeah. So, either this way or here. Probably no, that, that row, the row thing. Yeah. Here? Yeah, anywhere on that row, he'll come back next turn. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
All right. Good job, Bruno. Um, I am going to go here. I've triggered that attack. So it's going to be one, two, three. So we've, oh, we've lost a gate and a key. No. Oh, but the monster's gone now. It's no longer illuminated. This is gone. This is gone. Oof. Ugh. That's a lot. Yeah. Okay. Okay, back to the ship. However. Oh, sorry. I was supposed to add tiles. Actually, the tiles should have got added first. Then I discard, right? Yeah. What did I pull first? I pulled the gate first. Gate goes here. These one, two, three get tossed. Okay. That actually worked out in our favor. Okay. And then that's it. Okay. Well, I'm going to move here. So I get one, two, three tiles. Oops. <laughs> I get Sorry. it. Sorry. Okay. So. When I go here. And here. And here. Yep. Okay. The crumbly thing becomes a pit. Okay. And... Red got attacked too, right? Um... Mom, are you in yellow? I was oh, yellow. Yeah. Oh. So yeah, that was on Ruel's turn. So, the monster was here. Yeah, darn it. Wait, 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 no. No, the monster's over there. And it sees through here, so it sees us. Yeah, thanks, uh... Thanks, Shao. Okay, so three duo... Uh, okay, we'll get rid of one. So, oh, second key. Oh no, are there only six? There are six. Oh. So we need to get the next four. Okay. <sighs> yeah, if we get another, if we lose another key, game's over. Ugh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this one definitely is not going. Yeah, as we were. <laughs> I liked our first game better. Yeah. <laughs> okay, whose turn is it now? Um, Mine. Lauren's. Oh, and Lauren, yeah, we're gonna get attacked again. Why? Um, the, because you moved from that site, it will we will lose the monster, but we are still going to get attacked. Why are you going to get attacked? Because anytime you move in, any kind of movement, if these are motion sensitive, any kind of movement in their line of sight will trigger an attack. So what goes first? Do I lay the tiles? Yeah, or? lay the tiles and then we will... Uh... Ooh, Ernest. Um, monster... Eight. Yeah. Okay. Now, do we want to spend start spending some nerve to block? So instead of three, we discard two. It's your choice. I don't have any nerve to spend. Uh, you should have one. Oh, we, oh, we all start with one. Uh, yeah. Okay. I'll do it. So we'll draw two of these instead, uh, to the right on the board. Oh. Discard those two instead of three. Hey, we got rid of a monster. That's nice. Okay, now we go to our buddy Bruno. He's going to come back on the board somewhere in that row. Just sit right at the gate. Yeah. Right next to the gate, yeah. Okay. So we draw a tile. I think Bruno's going to land on this tile. Okay. And then he does his normal movement. So he needs just one. Oh, he's going to actually do a move. A then, move, yeah. okay. Then he does one tile below. Does he have a tile? No, he doesn't have a key yet. No. There's another, another gate. gate. Wow, we got a bunch of gates. Okay. Oh, my little. Oh, never mind. Okay. Now it's back to me. Um, and Bruno's lights out now. So he was coming back to the pit. The pit. Um, I'm going to go here. And then one, two, three, drop three. It's all just these things. Where are all of the keys? No. And then let's see, anything that needs to be taken off with illumination. This one? Oh, that one stays. Because uh, it could be. Oh, like, just kidding. I keep forgetting that. Yeah. Around. Pac Man style. Okay. Uh, back to Michelle. We need to find some keys. Um, We're getting in trouble, folks. Hmm. 
I'm gonna move here so I get two tiles. Ugh. Yeah. So many monsters. Okay. You're wax. Yeah. Wax. Okay. Tag. Oh, what was it? Wax eaters? <laughs> I don't know. I can't <laughs> even remember now. It's just earwax. Barry's in the house. Hi, Barry. Thanks for joining us. Yeah, okay. Night Cage is super creepy. Super good. I'm do this. Okay, so. Oh. Okay. Any illuminating things we need to get rid of? So this one's good. This one. Those go along with that. That one's good. Okay. Oops. That's good. I think that's it. Okay. So the straight ones, the, the standard ones go on this pile. Okay. Yeah. All right. You're in. Okay. Gotta find some keys, yo. We're yeah. probably at the very bottom of the deck. <laughs> Uh, and now, if your light's out, you can only move one space. Right? Can I recon? At, or, 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 recon. Recon, yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. And then, I can't lay any tiles because I'm lights out, right? You lay only one. Oh. Let's check the lights out. Uh, you're in a panic, compelled to move every turn. Without light, you may move forward blind to the dangers ahead. When you move, draw one tile only for the space you move into. And discard this tile from the space you left off of. So I shouldn't have laid the new tile. Yeah. Wow. We gotta get to Lauren so we can light the candle. Okay, uh, Bruno's turn. Bruno is lights out as well. So should we? He cannot one? stay yet, he has to move. Okay, so. You could spend nerve to stay, but we're gonna lose two gates. Should we let him stay? Because you automatically, with your lights out, you lose the one you were on. Oh. And the other one will not be illuminated. Uh, lights out. Can you speak? He can spend nerve to stay. Should we just have him spend yeah. a nerve? Yeah. And normally, when you, on a uh, normal turn, if you say you can. Uh, uh, you get a nerve, but because your light's out, you do not gain an additional nerve. Okay, so that's Bruno's turn. Mm -hmm. Poor Bruno. Things are not looking good here. Yeah, this is getting ugly, folks. Uh, I'm going to go here. And I'm going to uh, rebuild three times. We need to get a key. Oh, oh key? gosh. Really? Oh, yeah, this is brutal, folks. Okay, that's the end of my turn. Okay, so is everything yeah, illuminated? I think, uh, this one is gone. This one is gone. Oh, and this one's gone. Oh, yeah, yay. That was earwax, right? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I think everything else is good? Yeah. Okay. I don't have a good feeling about this one, folks. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, red dot attack too, right? Yeah, when I moved from here. Yeah. But what? Oh, oh, okay. Just to clarify, when you move out of sight of the monster, you do activate it, but doesn't affect the one who stepped out of sight. Just any other that rem remained in its sight. Oh, okay. So we, I think we've been playing a little more difficult. Thanks, uh, Zhao. Two more tiles and hope that maybe one is a key. Yeah. We have a couple of tiles because yeah. the stripes on my jacket keep falling off. I oh. <laughs> I need one. Sorry. <laughs> Still no keys. Yeah. Where are the keys? Okay, so yeah, Michelle's uh, that triggered an attack, but she's evaded it, so no penalties. Okay. And then you can remove anything that's not illuminated. Including the monster. I need to find those keys. Good, I know. Look, look how, they're probably at the bottom, but that's not good. Okay. <laughs> go, Lauren, go. So I Save us, Lauren. just have to lay something down. Only one, right? 
the monster. Oh, yeah. What if I put it here so it can't get me? No, uh, it has to go to an open passage. <laughs> Blue urns. Okay, that's all I can do. <laughs> um, but you do have to move on to it. Oh, I don't know. It lights out. Uh, without light, you move forward blind to the danger that when you move, draw a tile only for the space you move into and discard the tile from the space you just left. Ah. If no one else illuminates it. Oh God, so if you move on to a monster tile, a monster attacks immediately, hitting you and any other connected prisoners. Uh, you remain lights out, discard three cards, and immediately draw or scramble onto an existing adjacent tile or draw a new, newly drawn one. So we're going to get hit, and then you will move away from the monster onto a new tile. So, do I not have to like move off of this? Yeah, which is gonna. Yeah. Oh, perfect! So put it next to you, and you will go there. And grab the key. And then. Wait a second. I doesn't doesn't the monster like kick me off the board first? No, that's a pit. Oh. But here's the bad news: you just got a key. We're discarding key due to a monster attack. Oh, so we're we don't have done. <laughs> we're done, folks. We ran out of keys. We are trapped in the night cage. Oh, ah! bom, bom, bom. Wow, we played two games of this. I'm glad we got to see both ends of it. I mean, I wish we would have won last instead of lost last. <laughs> there it is. That is the night cage, folks. We're gonna be giving away a copy real soon. But what we're gonna do is. Let's clear, let's clear this up a little bit. Um, we're we're going to clear the team. We're going to play another game from Spurk and Dagger called The Deadlies. <laughs> this is actually based on the seven, is it seven deadly sins? Oh, yeah. Yeah. So we're going to play this. Um, if you're a fan of, fan of the movie Seven, uh, this has nothing to do with it except for the uh, seven deadly sins. And um, But it, it's a fun little card game. Uh, it takes about like 20, 30 minutes to play. Um, we're going to play. This is our first time playing it. Um, I'll teach it as we go. But thank you so much for hanging out with us. This is great. Uh, really happy to have a game night here uh, as part of TLN. Um, we want to thank Spark and Dagger for sponsoring. We want to thank um, AEG for being our raid leader uh, this time. Um, as we clear the board here, folks, let us know what you are playing right now. We want to talk about games. We want to know what you all are playing, what you're excited about. Uh, Joel, see what's in the box. What's in the box? Hopefully, it's well. Yeah. Spoiler alert: It's not something you want to know. If you're, have you all seen Seven? No. Oh, it's such a good movie. But I've never it even is. heard of it. Uh, really? Brad Pitt, Morgan Freeman, Gwyneth Paltrow. So good. I it, thought I don't remember. Yeah, it, it's a really creepy movie. <laughs> like that's where I get it from. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Sparky Dagger has uh, fun games. Yes, uh, Cutthroat Caverns is another good one. Yep. Yo, Goots, uh, Goop. Yeah, I really like the spill. Oh, the spill. Hey, Daryl Andrews in the house. Hi, Daryl. Good to see you on here. Um, I hope you all are. Is anyone dressed up while you're watching? Uh, I don't know if you're, if you're going to dress up tomorrow. We've got our ghost back there, thanks to Michelle. Um, Michelle and I have our uh, costumes. Lauren has her uh, Ted Lasso costume. <laughs> uh, let us know if, what costumes you have. Um, I stepped away. What happened? We, we lost. lost. Yeah, Victor, we got crushed. Uh, we found we found another key, but we lost a key, so we didn't have enough to get the four keys if the game immediately ends. <clears throat> David Finch for Must. He also directed Fight Club. That is right. Those two are classic. Board to Play says, just got home from a Halloween party. Still dressed as oh. Logan. Nice. Oh, I love it. Who's Logan? Logan. Wolverine. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I hope I see lots of Ted Lasso outfits. Gerald, are you a Ted Lasso fan? <laughs> Lauren. It is a big bet. So I'll give you that. This goes in the middle. Go ahead and uh, deal out six cards to each player, please. So this is based on the seven deadly sins you're going to encounter in the uh, devious little game. You're doing your best to get rid of all your hand, okay? And you get rid of your hand by playing uh, cards that are these similar numbers, similar suits, or straight, like a four, five, six. You can get rid of those. <clears throat> the top card that you play uh, will have a special ability. You also trigger that. If you get rid of all your cards, you've done it once. The first one to do it three times is the winner of the game. That is the game. So here is Team the MD day. is dressing as a square guard from Squid Game. They've never watched the show, but they have a tinted face shield and a pink hoodie tracksuit. That's very convenient. Have you have you watched the Squid Game? Before? Yeah, we yeah. have not yet. I asked I, mom. 
Yeah, okay. <laughs> Mom, she started watching it too. <laughs> she was like, no, I couldn't get past like the scene with um, uh, Gion and his daughter. And I was like, they're not even in the game yet. <laughs> it's like halfway through the first half, nothing scary. Is happening. <laughs> Betty told me it was Becca. She said, oh, you don't like it because you're too nice. <laughs> It's so funny. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Becca's, because um, Becca was really into it. Her and her husband watched it. And then we were talking, Michelle, like, yeah, I wasn't into it. Becca immediately said, oh, it's because you're a nice person. <laughs> yeah, it's a, it, it definitely appeals to, like, this like, very, like, dark side of humanity where you, like, you can't look away. Yeah. Like, you want to look away, but you can't. Right. Well, the father character, he's a... <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know another word to... Believe it or not, he's the good guy. Wow. What? Okay. Okay. See? Go ahead and pick one of these. It doesn't matter. They're all the same. Just pick your favorite color. You watch the first 10 minutes, Mom. <laughs> well, no. I watched a little longer than that, but I mean, the guy had like all kinds of issues. Already, I could see. I was totally analyzing it. Oh my gosh. Victor, okay, so Victor has clearly watched. Uh, uh, your token. Oh, I'm like, we're not. This, this didn't turn into a Squid Game review show. <laughs> <laughs> so go ahead and put it where the six is facing towards you. Okay. Oh, uh, and the six, six is facing towards me. Okay. Yes, I love Gion. I think um, I thought Songwoo was awful, but I watched this video of all the cast members, and they're all like, oh yeah, I would have been Songwoo. Oh, you think very differently. <laughs> <laughs> so the most angelic player will be the starting player. The oh, most... I guess we know who that is. <laughs> oh, thanks. I'll go first. <laughs> it's a, otherwise the owner of the game or host begins. <laughs> uh, the starting player gets an additional card. So, uh... and, and, and you know, I'm sorry, I was stealing the cards when yeah. you were uh, telling me the directions. Yeah, so I can't multitask very well. Uh, Lauren, you're gonna go first. So we'll go ahead and draw an extra card. It's because I'm most angelic. You're huh? most angelic. Correct. Yes. <laughs> the object of the game is to get rid of your all your entire hand of cards three times. Okay? okay. On your turn, you're going to play one or more cards face up, and you can play them either. Um, you can play a straight like this, like four, five, six. Okay, and then you will trigger that ability. Or you can pay, play the same suit, the same color, okay. one, five. Or you can play the same number, such as five and five. Okay? And whatever card you play on top, it has to be the highest card in your hand uh, that you're going to trigger that ability. And you just read it and do it. Okay? Okay, read it and do it. Yep. Uh, if, you have, my glasses. <laughs> uh, uh, if you have no cards in your hand, then you're going to... We are wicked. This is our wickedness tracker. Uh, if you have no cards in your hand, you're going to click it down here like that to four. If you do it again, get rid of our cards, you go to two. And then finally, if you do it the third time, you go to zero and you have won the game by getting rid of the uh, seven deadly sins or whatever it is. Okay. Okay. Um, any, and then uh, there's different effects for all the cards. We'll go those, uh, we'll just um, read those out and uh, explain them as we go. Okay. Uh, there is one called a, uh, there's the purity card here. You have to play, um, uh, this is the halo. You have to play a purity card to get that. Um, and we'll just, again, we, we, um, yeah, we'll, we'll just play it as we go here. Shell says this game looks cuter than the, the movie seven. <laughs> <laughs> Way cuter. <laughs> okay. Um, so Lauren, we go first, please. Yes. So let me look at the, uh, the object is. Greed, pride, wrath, etc., etc. Just three of the seven deadlies you will encounter in this devious little card game. Do your best to rid yourself of them all as soon as you can while your opponents do their damnedest to fill your hand with more. Empty your hand three times to win and become the envy of all your friends. Okay. Lauren, would you like to play? So, it really, you're trying to play as many cards as you can every turn. Okay. Okay, Lauren, will you lead, please? Yes. I have a straight. Okay, so the top one, pride, will trigger. What is pride, Lauren? It says, ask another player if they have pride. If they don't, they draw a card. If they can reveal a pride, you draw a card instead. Okay, who will um, you ask? I will ask Mom. Do you have pride? I do. Show. Okay, Darn. and then back to your hand, Lauren draws a card. <clears throat> okay. Okay, and this is the angelic pile, and then we'll, we'll do this as the discard pile here. Okay, nice and neat. Okay, and then we'll go clockwise, so I'll go next. Um, 
I'll play. Um, let's play. Book of Nerds is asking what we're dressed as. Oh, Book of Nerds. Thanks. Book of Nerds. Hi. Me and Michelle are the. We have a team costume, or a couple costume. Lauren has a costume from the hit show on Apple TV. Yes. Can you guess? Also streaming. <laughs> <laughs> On other sides. <laughs> so, Michelle and I, uh, our shirts have the letter P on it. And then, if you look here. It's for Kyra. Yes. Well, uh, John, uh, Michelle and I are the black eyed peas. And then, Lauren, would you like to reveal your costume? I'm Ted Lasso. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for asking, John. <laughs> okay. At a Cleveland game. Uh, it's my turn. Uh, I'm going to play. <laughs> um, I'm gonna play uh, this one here. I, actually, I'll, I'll play Pride again. Uh, I've got uh, two of the same color. Pride. Ask another player if they have Pride. If they don't, then they draw a card. Um, Lauren, do you have Pride? I do. Okay, so. Oh, wait, what, uh, why did I do that? I don't both, know. I know both of you have Pride. Yes. Darn it. <laughs> Damn. You did it anyway. Who earns? Okay, and then Michelle, your turn. Okay, I have a straight. Oh. So I have greed. Greed. Okay. Let's deal cards to the others. You may stop after dealing at least two that are not greed. Okay. If any two other than greed match suits, Stop and place them all into your hand instead. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. So it's basically a push your luck. You deal five successfully and discard your hand. Oh. Oh. So you will deal one to Lauren first. Um, so we are trying not to uh, deal um, cards that are not greed. Okay. So one to Lauren, then one to me. Right. And envy. Now. If you stop before busting, the players must place the cards dealt to them into your hand. So you can stop now. We have to place these, or you can push your luck. If you can, you deal one more time. If you deal a total of five cards to us, you automatically discard your hand, and you will get the first win. You know you like to push that luck. Plus, okay, that's three. She needs two more. Are you gonna stop now? With these going in our hands. Oh, oh no. Michelle's gonna go. Let me. One more. You discard your whole hand. What do you think? Stop now. She's, no. She's going to go for it. Greed. Greed. Ah. Uh, I get all of them. Is that right? Yep. Those you discard, but these uh, okay. five you get in your hand. So close. Michelle loves to push her luck. <laughs> that is her I jam. I to stop. That is her jam. Okay. Hey, Quaid Ryan, how's it going? Um, we love the night cage, which we're going to give away in just a few minutes. Uh, we are currently playing... The Deadlies, another game from Smirk and Dagger. Really fun uh, little card game here. It is Lauren's turn. Another, what is this? Lust. Uh, straight? Straight, yeah. Two, three, four. So Lust, pick a partner. They choose, nothing happens, and your turn ends. Or oh. you may both discard a card from your hand, choose that card and get it ready. Reveal the cards at the same time. Each player that discards Lust in this way forces their player partner to draw three cards from the deck. Oh, okay. So what do you choose? Nothing happens or the and other one? Huh? So basically, if you take option B. If you take option B. Oh, I have to choose. Oh. Nothing happens and your turn ends. And you just lose that. Or you may both discard a card from your hand. Choose that card and get it ready. Reveal the cards at the same time. If that each player that discards a lust forces their partner to draw three cards. Um, I will take that option, Lauren. You'll take B? I will take B. There's my card. You know what's coming. <laughs> lust. Right. So I have a Lust. Um, you have to draw three cards in your deck. Can those get discarded? Does mine get discarded as well? I think we just reveal. So the one that you reveal, you keep. Reveal. Right. right? Okay, and then it's my turn. I've got uh, these two here. I'm going to play 
yellows for greed, uh, deal cards to other players, and do what Michelle did. I'm going to push my luck. So Michelle, will you draw? Or I'll, I'll draw them out here. Michelle's asking if that music from the Night Cage. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, we're going to turn off the Night Cage. <laughs> <laughs> no more creepy music, folks. We're going to pause it. Unless you all want it. Let us know. <laughs> yeah. Michelle is gluttony. Lauren, greed. Oh. oh. So what happens? I Do I take these in my hand? Yeah. Dang it. Let these go away. Okay, Michelle. Okay, so you're trying to get a straight or a pair? Or, or the same color. Or same color. Yeah, and pair, not pair. You could, uh, if you have five of the same number, you can play all of them. Okay. Yeah. Um, do this. Okay. Pride. Ask another player if they have pride. If they don't, they draw a card. If they can reveal a pride, you draw a card instead. Okay. Um, you well, do you have pride? I have no pride. You have Aww. no pride. Okay, so... Like, if they don't, they draw a card. Yep. And then you just get rid of those ones you played. Okay. Okay, Lauren. One, two, three. So, I place Sloth in front of me. I discard it at the beginning of my next turn. And then all opponents with a Sloth card in front of them must draw a card. Which neither of you do. Oh, okay. So you're setting yourself up. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna play uh straight with five cards, two, three, four, five, six. I'm gonna play greed. Deal cards to the others may stop dealing at after at least two. So um I'm gonna deal Michelle one. Again, trying not to get greed, and there's greed. Darn it! <laughs> <laughs> you may stop after dealing at least two that are not greedy. If any two stop and place all into your hand. Dang it. Okay, and back to Michelle. Okay. And you said all the same number or all the same color? Yep, or, right? or uh, straight. Okay. Um, uh, here. Gluttony. Either take a random card from another player's hand or draw three cards, then take another turn. Oh. Oh. Oh, do you guys, you all want the uh, Night Cage music back on? I'll <laughs> put it back on. Okay. Okay, so I will take a random card. You only have two each? Yeah. Happen. I just played like a five card straight. Okay, I'm gonna take one from Lord. Okay. Then those get discarded. Okay. And then I take another turn. Dang it. Okay. Um. That fits in with the whole gluttony thing. This reminds me of um Spirited Away, that Hayao Miyazaki film. Oh. Okay, I'm playing Sloth. Oh! Okay, so place this card in front of you, discard it at the beginning of your next turn. All opponents with the sloth in front of them must draw a card. Okay. At the beginning of your next turn. Okay. So I discard at the beginning of my next turn. Yep. And then. She got the wild card. Corruption's wild. <laughs> so corruption. This card is all seven suits. Yep. Choose a suit when playing it has that suit's effect. Yep. So wrath. Force a player to draw two cards. Ruel. Okay, I draw two. I think that's it, right? You have played your cards? You After have... drawing, they may immediately discard a wrath, forcing me to draw two cards. And I don't have a wrath. Okay. So, Lauren, you have played you've played all your cards. Well done. So Whee! click that over to four. So now Michelle and I. Uh, we're going to shuffle the cards. We're going to draw six cards again, but now Lauren draws four cards. It's going to be a little bit easier for her to play. Uh, so may I have your cards, please? You know the ones in my hand? Yes. We're starting a new round. Lauren is up one win to zero. Johnny Deathhawk has joined us. Johnny, Johnny Deathhawk in the house. Him and Brainerd are streaming for the first time with TLN tonight at midnight. Midnight. Spooky hour. I feel like they've already been on TLN. They've been, you like, know? Yeah, they, they have, uh, like, as guests, but now they're, like, official, like, members. And, um, you know, TLN, we've we got a lot of love for a lot of people. So they, they were uh, been uh, TLN associates for, for many years. <laughs> So thanks for dropping yeah. by, Johnny. We had um, someone was talking you know, about a night cage that looks great. Yeah, uh, Quaid Ryan. We really enjoyed it. I, it's um, a really cool take on tile laying game and like a puzzle uh, co op game. So I, I really enjoyed it. Okay. You know, look, it reminds me of one of the games that we played early on uh -huh. where you place the tile and you moved. And you place another tile and you move your little thing. Yeah. What was the name of that game? Oh, gosh. Okay, 
So the first player in this case, I think, does it go back to Lauren? You're still the most angelic, right? I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to draw that many cards. Um, it doesn't say it yet, but I don't see it. Yeah, no, 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 so I discard the lower one, and Sloth is in front of me for the turn. Okay. Um. Okay, I'm going to play Purity. So the Purity... <laughs> I put the Halo card in my hand. This is the Halo <laughs> card. You laugh because I have Purity? <laughs> Gee, thanks. I could help. <laughs> so I played this. What the Halo card does in my hand, discard my entire hand. What flavor discard return the Halo face up to the table. So basically you're gonna have to try to get uh get me to get rid of that card. So I'm gonna win right here, 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 here. Um, oh, so you have wait. So that was your turn. That was my turn. So you don't get rid of your Envire card? Uh, your turn? when I play the Halo card. Oh. Now there's gonna be ways that you can play your cards that force me to like, you know, discard cards or whatever. So oh, okay. good luck. Mm. Oh, we're gonna see if this works. Now just straight let me either take a random card from another player's hand or draw three cards. Oh, then man. take another turn. Take more mine, right? Uh-huh. Okay, random card. Why are you shuffling again? It's gonna be random. <laughs> I wasn't gonna look. <laughs> Let me do this this way. Okay, random, 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 shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Okay. But it's not the one I want. Okay. He set you up for that. All right. <laughs> Legends Zena, Pokeball. Nice, Legends. Aloha, by the way. <laughs> okay, but I can take another turn. So do I I just put these back? Oh, you do take another turn. Yeah, nice, I can yeah. Take another turn. Okay. So, I have one, two, three. Okay. Um, ask another player if they have pride. If they don't, they draw a card. Okay. If they can reveal a pride, you draw a card instead. Okay. Lauren, do you have a pride? Wow. Ah. <laughs> hey, by the way, we have a raid coming in. Uh, thank you, Board Game Geek TV, for the raid. Friends, Wait, welcome. Raid. raid, raid helmets. <laughs> we are dressed up. We are, it's the TLN Spooktacular. Thank you so much, uh, uh, Board Game Geek. Let us know what you're playing. We've got 24 hours of live streaming board games going on here. We've got our costumes. You may know um, Lauren from the hit show. Ted Lasso! <laughs> I don't know if you know me and Michelle. We are not Pittsburgh Pirates fans, <laughs> but apparently people think they are. But uh, we've got the letter P. We've got black eyes. Um, we'll let you figure out the rest. But thank you so much for Fergie. joining us. Fergie. Yes, we yes. are Fergie. Yes, that's it. Or we are Will I Am. Who are, yeah. <laughs> Um, thank you so much, Burgundy TV. We just played uh, the Night Cage. We're going to be giving away a copy in just a couple of minutes here. And now we have moved on to a quick little filler called The Deadlies, also from our sponsor, Smurf and Dagger. Um, we are going to be... Is it my turn? No, it's mine. Oh, it's yours. Oh, okay. <laughs> Darn it. <laughs> Happy Halloween, friends. Thanks for joining us. If you're new to the channel, my name is Ruel or Buel. So our daughter Lauren or Goran and my wife Michelle or Witch Owl. Yes. Okay, so Hi, Joe. actually we just did this one. Yep. So Lauren had a pride and what am I oh. supposed to do? Um you if they don't card. okay. Board game spans in the house. Hi board game span. We're raiding you in like fifteen minutes or thirteen minutes. Okay. Let us know when you go live, by the way. And then we're going to give away a uh, copy. Of you know what? Why don't we do that? Uh, we're going to give away a copy of the Night Cage, folks. Thanks to our sponsor, uh, Spark and Dagger. So what you're going to do, I'm going to drop the thing here, giveaway. You, friends, are going to enter the word escape into chat. If you enter the word escape, you'll be entered into the contest for the Night Cage. Now, this is only U.S. only, folks. Uh, that's the... Um, the uh, uh, the limit or limitations of the contest, uh, again, thanks to our friends at Smirking Dagger. Type in escape, um, and you'll be entered to win the contest. Capitalization, capitalization does not matter, but good luck, everybody. We're going to give you a couple of minutes, and then we will run the game or run the um, contest. 
We're going to continue here. I don't know if we're going to be able to finish our game of uh, the Deadlies, but thanks again for sticking around. Uh, is it my turn? No, it's my turn. Darn it. I keep getting it. <laughs> it's Lauren's turn. Uh... Good luck, everybody. Escape for the Night Cage. Ruel. Yes. Do you have pride? I have no pride, Lauren. <laughs> that is unfortunate. Oops, I forgot. Okay. So, uh, you draw a card. I draw a card. Okay. And hey, I'm going to play my Halo. Discard my entire hand. That's my click over, and then we redo the. Uh, I have one card left. Oh, woo! Just got in time. Okay. Oh. So I've gotten four. Lauren got four. Oh. Michelle's got six. So, wait another minute or two, folks. Enter escape, and you'll have a entry into the contest for the Night Cage US only. And then we're going to be rating board game spam in 11 minutes. So happy you are here with us. You having a good time? It's been a while since we've seen together, you know. Yeah. yeah. Missed this. How's work going, Lauren? Uh, <laughs> it, is, it exists. Okay. It exists. Okay. How do you like adulting? Also exists. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> Lauren recently graduated, friends, and she is in the real world now. Yeah. The working one, I should say. It's the real world in, in school, too. But I understand why people go get their PhDs. <laughs> <laughs> it's just prolonging. I'm like, how inevitable. Long, <laughs> how long can I stay on student health insurance? Eight years? <laughs> okay. Three, 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 four, 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 five, and six. Uh, Zhao says, Michelle's laughs at Ruel's sins are gold. <laughs> I just couldn't help it. I it's just like out there. <laughs> uh Lauren, you, you shall begin. Okay. Um, um, mm -hmm. <laughs> um Joseph, congrats, Lauren. Oh thank you. Dead fans in the house. Hi, Dead Fan. Don't forget if you're US only folks, you have a chance to win the night cage from our sponsor, Smirk and Dagger. US only. Blah 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 blah. <laughs> I'm gonna play greed. Okay, what's greed? Uh, I deal cards to oh. other people, and I have to deal minimum two. Okay. Um, and two that are not greed, and then if I do pick up a greed within like five cards. Then... Okay, good luck. Push your luck. Push your One. luck. One. Last two. That was mandatory. Okay. Uh, okay. three. Ooh. Uh, four. Oh. <laughs> busted. That one's fun. Fun card. Uh, the one that you played though, that oh, you played. Oh. <laughs> yes, I can use I'll let that help if you can. Okay, I'm gonna play three, four, five, NB. So what NB says is draw two cards. Then if you do not have an NB in your hand, you may trade hands with any other player. Um, so I'm going to play this. Two cards. Do I have an envy? I do have an envy. Darn it. Who earns? Uh, so I just end my turn there. And it's to Michelle. Um, oh, I want to place down here. I think I, I'm going to do pride. Mm -hmm. So ask another player if they have pride. Um... Lauren, do you have pride? Indeed. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so if they can't reveal a pride, you draw a card instead. Wah, wah, wah. Okay, I'm going to run the contest. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. Whoops. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh. Man, it did this again. Everyone Why it... lost. Everyone, oh, man. Folks, I'm so sorry. Can you all enter escape again? Yeah, that was a nice practice round. Gosh, my bad. It, it's this hap it happens to me. I'm gonna have to ask Amanda how the heck this uh, thing works. I cannot get it to work. Sorry, folks. Type in escape. You'll be entered into a contest to win the night cage. Um, I'm just gonna wait here on this page just so it doesn't. Gosh, who earns? Okay, why is this eligible? Reset eligibility. Okay, everyone, type in. That word right now, escape. You'll be entered. Is it because I was it because of spam? No. Okay. 
Yeah, it says, okay, yeah, everyone uh, is typing escape. Okay. Yeah, it only says two. Okay, I'm going to do this, folks. Sorry. No, it says 47. Oh, oh and I just refreshed it. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It's just lagging. It's totally lagging. Okay. Right now, type in escape. You have, we have until we're going to raid. Okay, so I'm going to type in the right now. There it is. It's just lagging. Okay, thank you, Slovakia staff, for um, typing escape. You are entered. Uh, James is entered. Uh, Toro's entered. Do I do I have to say every single name that's entered? It's like taking attendance. Yeah, I don't want to do that because I don't want to, you know. Well, it, it's showing now. Yeah, it's showing up now. It's just laggy. Sorry, friends. You know what? You got to work for it. It's a free game. You got to work <laughs> for it. Look at the last thing you said. It was like a blue bullet point system. Oh, okay. Okay. It could be because it's not one of these here. Oh. Yeah. Okay. All right, cool. Well, we're going to wait. We're going to roll it in just a second here. Again, my apologies for that. Uh, is it Lauren's turn? Yes. Okay, go ahead and take your turn, Lauren. And, um, uh-oh. Agreed. Oh, here she goes again. That's two. Stop now, or? <laughs> two more. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. <laughs> Like I said, that must have been those dang waxy you know, <laughs> eating our everyone's chances. Yes, type in those. Yes. Oh, one more, Lauren. You do it. Nah. Oh, so we got to take these two in our hand? Yeah. Who are I got to discard all of them. Nice. Okay. Yeah. Is that going to help me at all? Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Oh, man. All right. Here we go. Uh, let's run the contest. Uh, looks like everyone, yeah, we got a bunch of people in. Thank you, friends. Good luck. Looks like everyone. Okay. Yeah. Good luck. Hey, Crystal Daxon's won. <laughs> Congrats, Crystal. Yeah, we finally had it done. Yay. And Legend says laundry is done. Nice. Uh, Crystal, yes. Um, Whisper me your uh, shipping address and email for confirmation. I'll get that out to Spark and Dagger. You have won a copy of the Night Cage. Congrats, friends. Uh, we've got uh, a couple more minutes, um, and then we're going to raid our friends aboard Game Spam. Are they live yet? They are live. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So we're going to wait. Um, we're going to get right to the 10 o'clock hour, and uh, let's see if we can finish this game. Um, I'm going to play Envy. Draw two cards. If I do not have an Envy, I may, I may trade hands with another player. Lauren, you have how many cards? Three, four. Well, how many cards you got? Four? Michelle, how many cards you got? Six. Okay. Uh, Lauren, I'll trade with you. So a few more. <laughs> and then, Michelle, your turn. Um, you're going to wish you traded with me. Because I got four. Oh, man. Okay. So I'm going to force the player to draw two cards. I have four. Well, Lauren has five. Well, draw two cards. Who earns? Okay, after drawing, they may immediately discard a wrath. No? Okay. Oh. Forcing you to draw too far. All right. So, That's the wrath of Ruel. And then, <laughs> <laughs> okay, and then repeat until no one um, can or wants to respond. Oh. Okay. So you, it, you could draw another wrath and force Ruel to draw two cards instead of you. Yep. If you have a wrath. Oh, how about that? Oh, man. Okay, so what do I do with the other card, then? Uh, no, you just play the Wrath. Just play oh, it. I just play that? Yeah. Oh. So you just keep responding. It's a Wrath. Yeah. It's a Wrath. Yeah. So you play the Wrath card. But do it, did I have to draw two more? Yes. You, you had to draw okay. two. Now, if you have right. another Wrath, go ahead and play, play it. The, okay, so I'm playing the Wrath. And go ahead and meet well. I do not have a Wrath this time. You have to take two. I take two, then you discard those, and your turn is over. Wow, you covered a lot of cards. Yeah, that was nice. But... Okay, hey, is that a Game Freak Geek Girl? Hello! <laughs> I think I'm Game Freak Geek Girl and Toro. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, here Who's we go. Your favorite? 3D printer. <laughs> a little throwback for y'all, if y'all remember that. Uh, Lauren, it's you. Ooh, we can say. Uh, who lost? Yeah. Oh, Mom. No wrath. No wrath. Oh, so you have to, yeah. So you play. You have to draw two cards. Yep. And then if you don't get a wrath, 
then you have to. Okay, I didn't get a wrath. Okay, I feel like you have to. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna play Lust. Uh, pick a partner they choose. Nothing happens. Either okay. Uh, Michelle, I'm gonna pick you as partner. You select either A, nothing happens, or B. You may discard each discard a card, and then a player that discards Lust forces our partner to draw three cards. So basically, if you have Lust, pick letter B. A. A. Nothing happens. Okay, done. Hey, speaking of done, we're gonna continue this game off camera. Uh, this has been Deadly's. Uh, friends, thank you so much for joining us. We played the Night Cage. We've given away the Night Cage. We're gonna raid our friends' board games fan. Can someone just uh, confirm that they are live? I think it says they're live here, but I'm not sure. Just want to make sure. Thanks, Grip Dog. Thank you, uh, Zhao. Thank you, Game for Geek Girl. Congrats again, Crystal Dax. Appreciate it. Gil Goots, good to see you, friend. Uh, made it. Gil <laughs> says, Ooh, made it the two hours without making a yellow P joke. You made it one hour and 59 Been minutes. So <laughs> close, Gil. We got the Black Eyed Peas. This is Ted Lasso. Friend, we really appreciate y'all. Please enjoy uh, the rest of TLN. Again, it's a marathon, not a sprint. Stay hydrated, eat well, get some rest, play a lot of great games. And uh, I'm still waiting for the Gaviola barbecue slash dance slash karaoke party, uh, Victor says. And also a game for Geek Girl. We, we need to make that happen. Can we do that? Um, Everyone going to Dice Tower West? <laughs> Dice Tower West, folks. Let's, let's do this at Dice Tower West, please. Um, Legend says Poke Bowl, Laundry Clean, and TLA Diallo. That's a, I think that's a great, great Great Saturday. evening. <laughs> great evening. Uh, let's just catch up here on chat. Um, let's go. All right. Yeah. Grip Talk, you're going to be at Dice Hour West. Awesome. Yes. Legends as well. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this will be so cool. T50 is in too. Yeah. Oh, I love Excellent. it. Excellent. See, I'm going to be there. Okay. <laughs> I believe uh, Board Game Spam is good to go. We are going to raid them. Let's show them a lot of love, folks. Let's get a hype train going. Uh, and I, I don't even know what else to say. Anything from uh, my co-host tonight? Yeah, I'm just reading everyone that's going to be there. Thinker Themer is planning to come. Yes. Oh. Thinker Themer here. Hi, Thinker Themer. Well, no, Griff Dog says. Oh, Griff Dog. Oh, yeah, yeah. They, I believe they are planning. Yes. Uh, Dice Hard West, here we come. You, you know what? Keep that in mind as we, you know, show that love, uh, that convention love. Let, let's bring that hyped energy to board game spam right now. Uh, they're going to be playing Bass of the Mysterious Manners, and we're going to start the raid right now. Um, I'll take us off screen. Any final thoughts before we go? Happy Halloween. Happy, Happy Halloween, Halloween, everybody. All right, bye. Take care. Bye. Stick around for the raid. Here we go. Um, let me get the raid. The spam. raid. <laughs> got, yeah, let's go raid spam. Thanks to our raid leader, AEG, folks. Thank you, um, AEG. We're going to raid and get out of here and uh, show some love to Board Games fan. T L N. 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 I believe we are. Ah, yeah. We raided. Yay.